Hello everyone, and welcome to my Vanderpump Bombshell channel. I hope everyone is having a wonderful day. Before we begin, please hit the subscribe button and give this video a thumbs up. Vanderpump Rules fans at long last got every one of their inquiries addressed about Tom Schwartz and Sheena Shea's stunning makeout meeting. During another episode of the show, which broadcasted on Tuesday, Walk 26, Schwartz, 41, dropped the bomb on Lala Kent while talking about the repercussions of Tom Sandoval's notorious undertaking with Rachel Rachel Levis. What, Sandoval, did contrast it with what we have all finished? I think everybody has tricked here and there, Schwartz noted. Everybody has cheated. We have all cheated. Like I have done moronics, Ty was a makeup skink. I made out with Shiana like a long time back in Vegas. Nobody even knows that. It was such a long time ago, and it was the most harmless thing of all time. Lala, 33, was shocked by the disclosure, promptly requesting more data. Shorts, be that as it may, didn't appear to have many insights concerning the previous dalliance. I don't have the foggiest idea. Be that as it may, it was some place in Vegas. Me and Katie Maloney were dating yet. It was a rough second, Schwartz said about Katie, 37, whom he was hitched to for a long time before she petitioned for legal separation in 2022. I simply needed to put it out there and let the record show that we are human. We as a whole do moronics, some of the time. This is the late spring of absolution. Schwartz likewise guaranteed that Sheena, 38, brought it up as of late, adding, at some point before the end of last year, we were at a party around special times of year, and she's like, do you recall when we made out? And I was as, we made out. We sort of made out. While Schwartz trusted the data wouldn't spread all through the gathering, it didn't take long for Lala to tell Katie. Lala made sense of her disappointment with the circumstance when she scrutinized her companionship with Sheena. Sheena, and I have gotten very close. We have turned into one another's vaults. Lala noted in a confession booth. It simply appears to be unusual to me that never in time she told me. Like what? Katie was similarly as amazed when Lala updated her on Schwartz's most recent affirmation. What the genuine F? Kate, might it be said that you are messing with me? I simply have such countless inquiries. When was this? What's more, where precisely was it? Katie inquired. Was this the time Schwartz said he went to Vegas in 2013 and said he made out with Sheena's companion? Was it really, truth be told, Sheena? There are simply such countless lies in this gathering that keeping track is difficult. As per Katie, she had no memory of Schwartz visiting Las Vegas with Sheena without her on the outing also. Katie and Schwartz affirmed their split in Walk 2022 and their separation was concluded soon thereafter after over 10 years together. Katie thusly circled Ariana Medics in On the Show too. During the gathering discussion, Lala referred to Shiana and Schwartz's mystery as gross, while Katie let it out irritated her to get familiar with the subtleties such countless years after the fact. Shiana, notwithstanding, had her own form of the story when gone up against by Katie, saying, what happened was me and Ariana were with my mother and sister at her secondary school cheer rivalry in 2013. Also, Schwartz pulls me in the corner and kisses me. I think Mike, Shay, and I were simply connected with at the time. Katie brought up that Sheena called the experience a basic kiss while Schwartz alluded to it as a makeout. That was not a makeout, Sheena kept up with. Might I at any point let you know who I was making out with on this excursion? Ariana. I needed to imagine like this won't ever occur. I never told Shay or my mother or my dearest companions. Despite the fact that Sheena described it as no biggie, Katie wasn't excited about the circumstance. I'm presently investigating the course of our fellowship. You have been a bridesmaid at my wedding, and this has never come up, Katie noted. I would have expected with Tom that he has completely made out with one million young ladies. In any case, I was a messed up individual. I was a shell and my self-assurance and worth was close to nothing. She proceeded. I would have expected something like this from Schwartz. 
Yet, she and I had in a real sense a very long time to enlighten me concerning this. I could do without liars and particularly lying by exclusion. It makes me keep thinking about whether I will at any point be actually completely ready to trust or be near Sheena. After her discussion with Sheena, Katie carried it up on screen to Schwartz too. As of now, we are finished. Furthermore, I'm happy about that for these exact same reasons. She educated her ex concerning his disloyalty, which has been reported on Vanderpump rules throughout the long term. It is something else kept from me. Schwartz got baffled when Katie referenced his kiss with Sheena again before Lisa Vanderpump. In particular, Katie ridiculed Schwartz for blowing it with her and bumbling so hard that he wound up with messy Joe, egg, a Joe Winberg. Despite the fact that me and Katie had a wild relationship, she would get me extremely furious and I had a ton of repressed disdain with her. Schwartz made sense of for Brock Davies about how he would periodically kiss different ladies while in a relationship with Katie. I would deal with it in the most weak manner and would fight back by gettings. Taste and making out with an outsider, like the best F, ruler weakling in the world. Yet I needed to plunk down with her and say, I'm F, Lord sorry. Brock encouraged Schwartz not to feel awful by uncovering that Katie laid down with his dearest companion Max Boyens one day earlier. The discussion set off a chain response as Brock faced Katie about attempting to disgrace Schwartz for a kiss that happened 10 years prior while she connected with her ex's buddy in the current day. At the point when I asked him three months into our detachment not to f around in this gathering, he didn't give a solitary f about my thought process. Katie answered, while alluding to Schwartz making out with Rachel, 29, during season 10. The episode accordingly finished with the cast in conflict as they responded to Brock's admission about Katie and Max, who showed up on season 9 of Vanderpump Rules prior to being terminated. In the sneak look at the forthcoming episode, Schwartz defied Katie about her hookup with Max at an occasion that is set to incorporate Max X and Katie's ongoing companion, VPR alum Dana Cathan. During another episode of the show, which broadcasted on Tuesday, Walk 26, Schwartz, 41, dropped the bomb on Lala Kent while talking about the repercussions of Tom Sandoval's notorious undertaking with Rachel Rackle Levis. What, Sandoval, did contrasted with what we have all finished, I think everybody has tricked here and there, Schwartz noted. Everybody has cheated. We have all cheated. Like I have done moronics, I was a makeout skank. I made out with Sheena like a long time back in Vegas. Nobody even knows that. It was such a long time ago, and it was the most harmless thing of all time. Thanks for watching if you like this video, so please don't forget to subscribe to my channel and don't miss any updates.